Gantia Blackbird to Blackbird's Brew. Happy Monday and welcome back to the series Celtic Triads. This week we're talking about three things from which never to be moved. These triads were compiled by John F. Wright in 1995. So let's look and see what the full triad reads. Three things from which never to be moved. One oaths, one's gods, and the truth. So let's start with your oaths. Imagine a world in which it is common and expected that people keep their word and those who do not are not tolerated in society. We would be living in very different circumstances and many of the problems we're facing today would either not exist or would be much smaller and easier to address. We should not give our word lightly, whether it's a promise to fulfill a task or a vow taken on our wedding day. We should say what we mean and mean what we say and live up to our words with deeds. That is how people will determine if we are trustworthy. Now, let's think about our gods. There's a very flippant attitude towards religion and spirituality, and it makes a mockery of the possibility of forming a deep connection and bond that we should have towards and from our deities. If our relationship with the gods is superficial or on rocky footing, then that could have a lot more to do with our conduct and our lack of commitment and whether or not we're actually making an effort to know them and learn from them than it does with the deities themselves. Why should they invest in us if we can't take time out of our day to invest in them? And certainly we should not profess worship for deities that we do not truly reverence, nor should we abandon our gods just because someone outside of us pressures us to do so. It is betrayal. Now, last but not least, we have the business of the truth. This is very tricky. Our perceptions are by nature limited. We do not often see the whole picture or how things look from our vantage point may not necessarily accurately, accurately reflect the objective reality of it. We have limitations and we have to work within them. But despite that, there are things on which we can know and be able to prove that they are solid. And those are the things that we should stand by, whether or not it's fashionable or what other people are pressuring us to do. We should not have our convictions determined by other people. That has to be an honest conviction from within ourselves. We should not abandon our knowledge and we should especially should not abandon independently verifiable facts. I mean, that's how you get it, a whole generation of people saying that two plus two equals five instead of four. Now there is a danger in sticking to our guns too much. We can become stubborn and we can uh, confuse our perception of reality with the reality itself. So it is important for us to keep an open mind and be willing to hear reasonable arguments people who are able to back up their claims and make an actual case and to be able to entertain that. After all, we cannot stand by the truth if we do not grasp what it is. So there is a, a major balancing act to be found in this. So that's what I got out of this week's triad. Let me know about your own thoughts and impressions, either in the comments section below, or you can come see us on Discord at Blackbird's Brew. There's a link to join in the description box below, and you'd be very welcome to join us there. But that'll do it for this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! I'm <laughs> sorry.